And that we're looking good. I think there's like a 15 second buffer in when this goes up. Yeah, looking good. It'll take a second for the bit rate to, to pop up, I think. Cool. Uh, let's check and see if my bot is up and running. It is. Um, awesome. Welcome to the stream. Uh, so today I don't have a goal of beating any bosses. I think I probably will uh, go down to the castle down here. I think Castle Morn, I want to say that it's called, and we will fight the boss there, I think. But right now I'm just trying to level up, collect a few things, uh, do the build, get some more items for the build. That's the plan today. Uh, I've got to get... Um, a spell for the build. I've got to get a few other things. Uh, if you haven't been here before, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to become a Great Jar Warrior, which entails getting to the DLC and acquiring the Great Jar Helmet. Uh, I want to be consort to Alexander. Alexander, the Warrior Jar, who has a quest line in this game. It's a side quest line. We'll be doing that uh, as well as like playing through the game. I haven't played this game in two years, so I'm enjoying playing through it and kind of experiencing it again. I played the DLC recently and completed the DLC, so I'm kind of doing... This is my... It's my second time actually playing through the full game. I haven't done a second playthrough before. I just picked up my old character from before and went into the DLC. So, yeah, it's fun kind of experiencing the game again for the first time. What it feels like the first time, anyway. So, yeah, we're going to kick it off. First thing I'm going to go and do is go and get this spell that I need to see what kind of stats I'm going to need to wield uh, I think it's called shield some scholars shield it's it's a spell anyway to um, increase the physical non-physical damage negation of your shield so basically like anytime I get attacked by a magic attack uh, my stats are a lot lower than uh, so like I block 100% of physical damage, but if it's a magic attack, I don't block 100% of the damage. So this spell will help me get up to being to blocking 100% of the damage. Um, so yes, currently I'm wearing the prisoner helmet uh, until I can acquire a jar helmet, which you get halfway through Alexander's quest, and then after that we'll get the. Um, the great jar and the DLC and that will kind of be marking the end well no I will go and I'll, I'll fight the main boss at the end of the DLC probably won't have a good time at it but we'll do it anyway um, so yeah this is kind of a key part oh honestly didn't know there was a boss in here ah okay yeah this guy Yeah, this isn't too bad with this shield. This shield build is kind of broken, and that's why I've been using it, because it's kind of entertaining. Yeah, so, kind of, that was nice and quick. I've been enjoying this shield build a lot, though, just because it's kind of broken using a, a rapier behind a shield, because you can just, like, keep stabbing. Uh, while blocking, and you just gotta make sure that you have enough um, guard. I can't remember what it's called. What's the status effect? It's not in here. It's in equipment. Guard boost. It's all the way over there in the middle of the screen, the bottom of the guard damage negation. Guarded damage negation. Yeah, you just gotta make sure you have enough guard boost so that your stamina doesn't disappear when you're using this. I am Selen, a sorcerer, quite plainly. Why are you here? 
I want to learn sorcery. Yep, because you have something that I want. Well, you are a piece of very well. You but I refuse to coddle or cast kind anticipate grievances. Okay, study sorcery. Oh, she gave me a spell. Uh, yeah, this is the one that I want. Scholar's Shield, here we go. So I need 12 int to be able to have that, which I don't think I have 12 intelligence. Oh, I have 14 intelligence. I think I haven't put any stats into intelligence, so I have a feeling that the 12 intelligence is from probably this character that I started with, the prisoner character. It's the only thing I can think of, because I don't know why I would have 12 intelligence otherwise. Um, yeah, okay, well, I guess we'll, we'll, we'll go with that. Um, so now we've got it. I'm going to equip it just so I know that I have it. And then I need to get a, a staff that I can actually equip so that I can use it. Where is this memory spell? Uh, yeah, this was the spell that was automatically equipped on this character. So I'm going to get rid of that and do this. And I don't know if I have... Actually, I need to this hand. I don't know if I still have... Oh, I do have a glintstone staff, which... Turns out I can actually equip, which is nice. So actually, I might be able to start using this straight away. Hold up. Oh, I actually can't. Okay, I actually wasn't expecting to be able to use this straight away. <coughs> I thought I'd have to respec some stats to be able to use the Scholar's Shield straight away. That's good to know. Um. Okay. Right, I might go straight on to Castle Morn then. We'll see. I have to I have to think about some of the stuff that I want to grab. And I do kind of need to level up a little bit here. Because um, last time, if you weren't here, I did some co-op with uh, two, of my, two of my buddies. And we did uh, the Academy of Royal Lucaria over here. And beat Renala. And I felt horrifically underleveled for everything that we were doing. So... I think it will be uh, time to go and get some levels and level up a little bit. So let me see where are we gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna go to Castle Redman, I think. The Grace is guiding me that way. Although I am not guided by Grace, I'm guided by Alexander. <laughs> Now, I know there's this archer guy. Okay. Yeah, sticking to the right blocks that. Oh, good seed. Need that. Okay, we're gonna hide behind here. He's gonna shoot. I'm gonna go around this way. Okay, and now once he's shot, I should. That should give me enough time to get to him. surprised by that. <laughs> that was uh, a lot more damage than I was expecting to do to him. Maybe I'm overleveled for down here. Pot I potentially am. Okay. Okay, let's put on our torch. Little lantern. On we go. I probably should have checked to see if I can upgrade uh, 
Uh, oh no, I've only got one golden seed. Seed. I think I need a few golden seeds at the moment to be able to upgrade uh, it to a higher level. Oh yeah. Okay, I remember this being kind of hard. If you didn't know, I'm not particularly good at this game. That's why I'm using a terrible shield build and also using summons. Trying to use not working. I was trying to use a heavy attack there, but that wasn't happening. Game was like, nah. You're you're still on I needed to press Y to get out of the menu. Oh I thought I got a backstab, no. Yeah, let's take these guys one by one. Two by two, that'll loop. So as you can see there, the build coming into play there, I can block and hit at the same time, which is incredibly broken. There we go, that's what I was trying to do the first time. Oh, that guy's bigger than the others. That's why they were doing some... Yeah, thought he'd get me through that. Interesting. Okay, so I can like stun them in their like midair. It is very pokey this build. Okay, let's go. See where we're going next. About to get pants there. Oh, Claymore, nice. I have a fun build from the DLC with carrying and sovereignty with that that's just completely broken and way too strong, but it is very entertaining to do. I know. didn't remember that this where there was this area over there over here I mean I don't actually know where I'm going right now off this ladder but I guess we'll find out oh, well, all the guys are fighting okay okay well these guys are clearly winning although I'll get the archer guy because he'll annoy me seem to be doing way more damage than the actual soldiers. So, uh, oh, I did Flint soldiers didn't really want to do that, but anyway. Oh, I told some uh, some lady that I would deliver her note, and I do remember that her note is on that tower over there. Or her father, I think it was, is on that tower over there, so I'm going to go deliver the note to him. I need to figure out how to get over there. That is quite a funny poke attack when they're like in midair. I wasn't really expecting that at all. Steel wire and torch. Hmm, okay. Well, I have this little lantern on my hip, so I don't really need a torch. <laughs> I was by the torch at the beginning of the game. I say always, the two times that I have played this game. I bought the torch at the beginning of the game from the vendor. Uh, but then, kind of, well, as soon as I can get the lantern, I get the lantern. Okay. 
Oh, I know where that ladder goes. That ladder you loop underneath and then you come around to that ladder. Okay, yeah, this works. This feels like a trap. Yeah, there's one up there. And they're shooting things at me. Uh, let's get a heal off. Just oh no, I'm on the wrong thing. How do, I, do they come down to hit when I get close? Yeah, they do. Okay. There we go. But he's gonna. Oh, he didn't quite fall. I'm not a huge fan of the heavy attack on this weapon. I mean, it's a cool kind of art. From like classic uh, if thrusting is the right word. It's classic from like rapier kind of hit in fencing, but it's just kind of a bit slow in this. And I guess I've gotten used to the kind of the fast one, two, three. So then having to like build that up and do that attack is just a bit slow. That was a that was a jump attack. He knew that I was looking at the guy who was defenseless, not paying attention to me. They love doing that in Dark Souls. An Elden Ring. Just like putting an enemy with their back to you and then hiding another enemy closer. So you think you're going to go and get this like backstab finisher thing but then there's an enemy waiting to like smack you before you get there and jump out on you. That's pretty common. <laughs> It's fighting over there. I should actually be able to craft some more of the jars now. Yeah, I can. Four. Let's make as many as I can make every time. Oh. Oh no, I don't want to go down there yet. I do wish to go down here though. Usually, in this scenario, I'm with the knight. But in this case, I hate the shield ones, so I'm going to do that. Okay, we get him, and then we finish him off. Nice. The one, two. Okay, this guy's kind of being bullied. I hate the flying guys, because they can shoot arrows. Get back here. My, short, my sword is really short, and... Oh my. I've never seen that attack before. Come on. Let me hit him. at the very start of this playthrough I really hated those knights with the shield because I didn't understand how to combo them or parry them or do anything to them. <laughs> okay, here's the guy that I need to deliver the letter to. Uh, there's a face I've not seen before. I'm Edgar, warden of this castle, as ordained by Lord Godric himself. But you can see how things have turned out. The menial <laughs> Lord Godric himself, Bell. I've already killed Godric, but anyway. This or so I thought, but it seems it was all an act. Foul creatures, as it said, and true enough, they're foul inside and out. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but whatever you come here to do, I'm afraid Castle Morn won't hold much longer. Take this, by way of apology. Okay, nice. Uh, deliver the letter. Thank you. I'm in your debt, but I can't leave yet, even if the castle should fall. As commander, I must to ensure the treasured sword of Morn does not fall. If you see Arena, her father will... If you see Arena, well, I'm going her father to... will come for... Well, I'm 
gonna make the castle fall a different way because I'm gonna go and fight the boss and get the sword. <laughs> So, onwards. We'll get ourselves a nice little checkpoint here. Try jumping. We shall appraise that. Anyone that gives any uh, message that gives you the correct information or makes you laugh, gets a thumbs up. <laughs> Okay. Now we shall keep going down the cliff. <gasps> yes, that is the that is the trap there. I keep forgetting that. You know what? Well, I haven't activated any enemies. I'm gonna go back because <laughs> I don't think I've ever jumped across over to that. I think every time I have done a roll and fallen down. <laughs> And I don't know what happens if you do actually make this. Okay, so it looks like there's nothing up here. There will be something down here, I assume. I gotta re-equip this. This feels like a trap jumping down in here, to be honest. Let's do it anyway. Anyone else in here? Oh, maybe not. Pickle turtleneck. Ooh. Ooh, that thing though. Okay, if I didn't bleed that, this thing has so much health. It's probably that it has so many resistances. More than it has so much health. Mm, poor guy, trapped. I don't know if it's worth going around and killing all these guys, like if they'll just like wake up. I can't remember if it's like I'll get to the end and all of them will wake up. I feel like that's the thing. Okay, skip that thing, it just takes too long. Oh, no, I want to be over that. Oh well. Interesting. I tried to do the guard break thing and it didn't work <laughs> and instead I just hit which finished him off so I guess it worked but just not the way I wanted it to there's something up here is there oh there's a chest double check for mimic I don't even know if there's mimics in Elden Ring twin blade talisman what is the temporary boost stamina recovery? Hmm, it's consumable that does that. Yep. Okay. Uh, let's see what is up. Oh yeah, jumped in here. And then we'll hop down here. Which I feel like I get attacked on this ledge. Maybe not. I don't think this is going to give me anything because I already have full access. Yeah. It's good to just break those scarab guys in case they give you an item but I think the red ones always just give you things. Well there's the boss arena. Big yellow fog gate and a uh, big kind of arena behind it. Let's have a look and see. <laughs> okay, I don't like that there's a blood stain here. I'd say it's probably because someone missed and fell the whole way down. Should have looked at the bloodstain. Okay, 
Okay, and then we're gonna drop down here into some rats. And then I'm gonna roll out here and funnel them. Just like that, because if I can funnel them, it's very easy for me to do the pokey. Ooh, ran out of stamina. Simple. Nice and easy. Simples. <laughs> I might have some jolly cooperation today. A friend of mine says he'll be home soon and he might join. I know he started a new playthrough as well. We've kind of been enjoying this uh, Alexander hype of pretending to be jars, but uh, you don't get a jar until like halfway through his quest, which if I go do Redan now, I don't know if I'm strong enough to go Redan. Maybe maybe it'll be okay, but if I go do Redan now, that will allow me to get to the middle part of his quest, which will get me a jar on my head. And I won't be a great jar warrior, but I will be at least a jar warrior. <laughs> Bleed, wonderful. Not so wonderful though when you get hit. Oh, two hits. This oh, I tried to dodge. This will kill me. Yeah, I tried to dodge. That didn't work. Uh, right then. Yo, pot friend. Kendo the brave. Uh, yeah, you came in at a bad time, I just died <laughs> to something really dumb that I shouldn't have died to. Uh, death counter increase time. Like, I absolutely should not have died to that, but anyway, it happened. <laughs> and stream should refresh. And now there is no death counter. What? <laughs> this, uh, I, I'm not too impressed with the refresh on this. Oh. I've just realized Streamlabs doesn't even think I'm streaming. <laughs> says I am, but no image is appearing in the game capture section. Wonderful. Oh, thanks, man. Thanks for keeping it open while you're uh, while you're going for a walk. I'm trying to see. I'm trying to get this death counter back working because something weird just happened. Oh no. I'm gonna collect these because they're important to me. Oh, I'm having a bad time with this guy. Okay, we got the bleed off. Panicking slightly here. Which is getting me closer to death. down now that you've hit. Ugh. There we go. Oh, he's up there. Okay, we got him. There we go. Now, in this instance, jellyfish are friend, not food. So, I'm not gonna anger them. Just gonna walk straight past them. Wait, are these the chrysalids maybe that I meant to talk to? I can't talk to these guys. Am I about to just like fall through the water? No, I can walk over here. There's like a whole coast down here. Gotta be careful that the water, like there, the water just suddenly has a drop. And sometimes I miss those and fall off. <laughs> 
Okay, uh, we're gonna do this, because I don't know what kind of attack he does. Then we're gonna do this. Then we're gonna do this. And I'm gonna bring in Jellyfish Friend. Oh, I do have good damage to him. And he also does a lot of damage to me. Back here. Leave Jellyfish alone. Oh, there's the bleed. He does. Actually, he doesn't have any magic attack. I should be doing... I should, I should do this instead, because it increases my guard boost, I believe. Which means... Yeah, he does way less damage. Well, damage is the wrong word, but... Okay. As you can see, this build is very broken. <laughs> Someone like me, who's not particularly skilled at this game, can do that. <laughs> it is, uh, yes, very easy. Uh, okay, let me see. Dex, strength, figure. Hmm, don't need those. Uh... Trying to figure out here what I can do. Level up. Oh yeah, let's get endurance to a flat twenty. That'll help. Okay, so we've done Castle Morn. So now, how many stone sword keys do I have? That is that's the real question here now. It'd be great if I remembered where stone sword keys were kept. But I do not. Key item? Yeah, there we go. Oh, I've got five. I've got loads. Okay, so with the stone sword key then, what I'm going to do is I am going to go... I think there's a castle somewhere here that has a thing that I want. Basically, I'm trying to get... Oi, oi! It's Donny! Uh, I'm going up to this castle up here, and I'm going to see if I can get... Uh, the talisman, the Pearl Drake talisman. Uh, I might die trying to get in there, though, if there's a lot of enemies, and if I'm underleveled. I also can't remember where place is. I don't know if it's this castle. I don't think it's this castle. Lux runes. I don't think it's the Lux runes. It's somewhere that has a... somewhere bigger than this, I'm pretty sure. That has like a basement. Oh, maybe it is here. Hold it. This looks more familiar. Mm, there. Oh, maybe it's down here. Maybe this is what I'm looking for. Although... Not particularly ready to fight a boss, but we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. I have no idea. Oh, okay. I don't remember. I don't remember fighting this guy before. I definitely did, but I just don't particularly. Oh, okay. Okay. I don't know what his attacks are. I haven't even seen it yet. Cause he's huge in a small arena. Okay, we bleed him. This is this is totally doable. I don't know what he's doing. Ooh. Okay, bleed again. Okay, this is this is doable. It's kind of nasty that it's in such a small arena and he's so big, but I do enough damage, so we're okay. Oh, staggered him. 
finish him off with a critical strike. Lovely. Okay. I, I thought that was going to be much harder than it was. Actually, I don't think he hit my health. <laughs> I mean, he hit my shield many, many times, but I don't think he hit my health at all. Oh, this is the Ritual Sword Talisman. What does that do? Raises attack power when HP is at maximum. <sighs> I don't like the duality of that in terms of like, if you lose a teeny tiny bit of health, you no longer have the raised attack power, but I kind of like that. I might equip that for now over the, over the Pearl Drake, over the Flame Drake Talisman. Because I don't always need fire protection, but this will always, I guess, uh, be equipped to some degree. Um, let me see that. Where is this talisman that I'm trying to get? Like I thought it was, I thought it was up here. I thought it was in this castle. I could be completely wrong, though. I don't know. I could be completely wrong. Um. I don't know, is there a big, maybe it's a bigger, this is, this is very small, maybe it's a bigger one, further up. No, I don't, maybe, is it that one over there? Why is he? Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, is he just going to finish me off? He almost finished me off. Why was he glowing? Crash. I was about to say clash. Nice. Okay. Um, maybe there's that one up over there. I'll go have a look. Ooh. Golden seed. Oh, bonfire. Sight of grace. I didn't think there was one here. Nice. Ooh. I have my Twitch thing closed. Sorry, boys. There we go. Let's have a look and see. Oh, talk to Melina. Okay. It just looks so strange. My character looks awful. <laughs> is close. Only a little further till the foot of the Erd tree. And the accord is fulfilled. It takes me back. I was born at the foot of her mother gave me my purpose. Though now, everything is... I have to ascertain for my... The reason for which I live. Burned. And bodiless. Poor Melina. Shall I turn your runes? Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment. If we touch yeah, fingers, I can level up. Wonderful. Your thoughts. Your ambitions. The principles you would follow. She's still talking and I'm here leveling up. Since I'm back over here, I might try and get the map fragment. Potentially. We'll see. I don't know where the map fragment is. Uh, I, I see a path up there, so I assume it's somewhere up there. We'll go up here and we'll see if we can find this Pearl Drake Talisman up here. Beast-eye quivers. The beast-eye quivers. What do I get from the beast-eye? Oh, yeah, the... I remember now. Oh, I don't really feel like fighting another Tibia Mariner. I don't really have the patience for that. <laughs> last one had so much health and it took forever, although I was under-leveled for the last one, so... That would kind of be why, I'd say. This is what I'm looking for. And this is stone sword key. Okay, there's a lot of people here though. I should probably take them on. Uh, 
Uh, am I dead? Oh, no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not yet. Okay, let's do the stone sword key. Yes. Can they hurt me while I'm doing this? Perfect. They can't. Lovely. Oh. Out of my way. There we go. Oh, I didn't do that. Oh, there's a whole bunch of people in here. I don't see an item in here. Although this could lead to an illusory wall. It does not. Oh, the boss thing is coming in here. Oh, he'll, he's kind of killing people for me. It's great. <laughs> I'll take that. Okay, I got what I wanted. We're getting out of here. We're escaping. We're escaping. Okay, let's see how much damage I do to the tibia. Where is he? Oh my goodness. Oh, all the way down there? Okay, let's see how much damage I do. I feel like I'm going to do like no damage and it's going to be another one that's just going to take forever. Oh, I haven't even hit him yet. I think the next one goes over here somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Yeah, that's not enough to be bothered to do this fight. Let him yet. Oh, I should have been watching other areas to see what was happening there. Wasn't ready for that. Twenty two. <laughs> Yeah, I really should have been watching where, what else was going on around me. Uh, did I have many cells? I don't know if I had many cells. I'll, I'll go back up and double check. Ah, uh, it keeps doing this. It keeps refreshing the... Oh, I know what I'm doing. I need to click onto it, click off it, and then hit save scene, I think. I think what I'm doing is I'm hitting save scene while I'm still editing the box. And it's not liking that. Nope, it's just being a bit buggy, the death counter. Ah, uh, it's it, it's a very simple thing, like it's just a text box is all it is. I don't know why it's having such trouble updating it. Might just be Streamlabs console, it just doesn't like it. Off of it, save scene. Kendo joins the stream. Kendo the Brave. Kendo the Brave has joined the uh, stream. Why is this death counter not updating? What is wrong with this? You're very quiet. Yas? Oh, a little bit. A little bit. Oh, wonderful. Wait, what do you mean it's easy fix? Uh, I, ca I can't do it because it's not, it's not in my options. I, I need to be the party leader, I think. Okay, you potentially did not hear me there, because I just realized that me joining a party, I think I have to host the party. Potentially. For it to allow... Yeah, 
Yeah, I guess we'll see. This should work. Um, but Kando needs to join. see it should work okay there we go few bumps but we're going uh, okay so that was very successful I got the talisman that I was trying to get greatly be oh it's plus one I did not know it was plus one that's great news so even better than just the standard one I that means I don't know where the standard Pearl Drake talisman is <laughs> I only know where the plus one talisman is okay uh, right, do I go back and try this again? So, the weapon that I really want is called the Ansper Rapier. And last time I tried this, I did like almost no damage to the uh, invader enemy that drops it. So, I will go back again and see. What do you mean, what's going on with the party? You, you need to join. <laughs> I've invited you twice. <laughs> You need to join the party that I have invited you to. It doesn't allow you to include audio when I'm not the host, basically, is what was going on there. There were no stream options for the party while I was uh, not the host of the party chat, the Xbox Live party chat. Oh, big troll. You're not in the party here. Yeah, no you're not. <laughs> I think that could be your... Your Xbox Live is being like, nah. Mm. If I join you, we can't have the audio. I can hear you. I just don't know if the stream can hear you because because it's not my party, so I can't enable any options. Yeah, no, stream can't hear you. Yeah, it ne it needs to be my. You you are appearing currently as disconnected. Oh. Now it says you've joined the party. Can you include your audio? What? Selected as on. I'll just turn it off and on again. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. I, I, I mean, it was on. I just need no, to turn I'd... it off and on again. That famous thing that always works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just got scratched rotted. Oh, and I just got assassinated. Oh dear. Did not know she could do that. No, no, she could do that. <laughs> oh, is there not? Is there not a side of grace that's closer? Wait, right, I need to go. I'm not on your stream just now, but I will rejoin it. I'm just um, I'm just doing the bull goat armor quest. Doing the what? Getting the bull goat armor. <sighs> I just died to the lady. 
Lady? Oh. Lady. I'm fighting that summon lady again. That invader lady again. <clears throat> yeah, I just, um... I didn't feel like playing catch-up with Bob. I was trying really hard. But I was like, right, you know what? I've had a nice few social bevs. <laughs> That'll do me. <laughs> I'm going home. <laughs> I just bounced. I got handed a Jaeger bomb. I was like, ah, oh, that's easy. And it nearly sent me. I was like, yeah, I'm not enough for this to be nothing. So... This is really bothering me that the death can thing is not updating. Like, all it is is a text box. Like, why can't it update? Hmm. It's a very simple thing. I'm actually not too impressed with Streamlabs console. No? No, I'm really not. Like, like it's the most basic thing like this. Like, why is it saying death count and then no letters after it? Like... At no point have I removed the numbers, and it, it, all it is is a text box. Like it's not like it's a um, uh, what should we call it? It's not like it's like a, a like a plugin that's like connected to anything that is like recommend. Like all I'm doing is typing into a box. <laughs> that's really weird. Here for a second and see. So stupid. Look, why is it not? How long and drawn out this quest can actually be. Yeah, come on, get out of your poison. Stop throwing poison everywhere. Build is coming together! Oh my god. That bushy fellow I was telling you about, he's uploaded a new video just there. Um, and it's one shotting every boss in the DLC. <laughs> oh. That's class. Man, you really need to what, watch his. What's um, the build? I don't know. You need to watch his fucking normal, sorry, his normal uh, playthrough. Um, like, he doesn't just go straight for Comet Azure, so it's really interesting because he's just doing a regular um, like strength build and all that in some places and doing other stuff as well. Like it's really interesting to watch. But um, yeah, well, I'll watch that tonight and then I'll let you know. But, um, build is gone with. Finally, we've stunned him. That took forever. Oh, now I can't get over to him because he's over the other side of a rock. Oh, this is so unfair. <sighs> I didn't know they had that attack. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, and he hit me off the map. <laughs> uh, 
I shouldn't have been fighting him that close. I was really hoping he'd sent himself off of the map, but he did not. <laughs> he just hit me off the map. Uh, and I do kind of want those 6,000 souls back, so I'm going to have to go back there. Uh, right. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, I am not using the best weapon for these uh, assassination <laughs> quests. <laughs> Okay, so we'll go back, we'll grab the souls, and then what will I do next? Let me see. So what bosses have you killed? Because on this character I've done... I've done both Godric and Renala. Yeah, that's all I've done. Yeah, in terms of remembrance bosses, <clears throat> that's all I've done. I was going to go and do Radan, but I was like... My, uh... Hold off on that no. I'm thinking about trying Redan. I've leveled up a little bit now, which is I mean, kind of the aim of this stream was leveling up a bit. I mean, don't get me wrong, I could definitely do it, but I was like, I don't want to mess up any quests just now, so I'll, I'll hold off. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if I can do it. <laughs> That's why I'm like, I might go check and see. Yeah, I can help you with it. Ah, uh, well, I want to do it with Alexander. I don't know if I can summon all the yeah, other boys. Yeah, you can still summon with uh, with players, but. I mean, if you don't want to risk it, just go for it with just yourself. But I'm pretty confident that it doesn't mess up. Um, well, we'll give it a go, and if it if it's not there, then I'll if it's I'll not there, and if you the signs play. aren't there, then I'll yeah, then I'll just die. Well, you won't need to die; just survive, and then you'll be able to quit out. Pop. 56 minutes. It's been quiet today in the stream. I think it's uh, mostly because it's Saturday and people are Saturday. out doing stuff. Yeah. At this time, people will be out drinking or something or are we doing some yeah. activity? Partying of some kind, yeah, on a Saturday. I mean, I'm going out this evening. Like. <laughs> oh? Um, um, Have you done much of that so. in the States or not really? Ah, well, I, when I said going out, it's mostly I'm going to the movie theater. I can't really... I, I've done it a few times, but I haven't been able to afford it. And LA is like going out in the middle of Dublin City. It's like so expensive. Um, and while I wasn't earning, I couldn't do that. Um, it's not a viable option. Yeah. Now that I'm earning again, though, it might be okay. Well, no, it really won't. I'm not into a comfortable place yet, so... Yeah, well, I wouldn't expect the uh, drinking to be a cheap activity in the States, to be fair. Oh my well, god, it's I It's more so just Los Angeles. Depends on where you live. Yeah, that's true. But how close to the city's, like, centers are you? Um... Cities are a different concept here, Ken. <laughs> There's no really place that I would call city center. There is downtown Los Angeles, which is, which I live in downtown Los Angeles. Uh, All right. Okay. But it's still like the city is still really, really big, and like mm -hmm. here, the way it kind of works is like it's a cluster of cities together. So like. Greater LA is kind of like is like ten cities together. So like Burbank is like part of LA, but it's considered a different city. It's called Burbank City, kind of. And then like Hollywood is technically a different city from downtown Los Angeles. So it's like I don't know how to describe it. It's very different from Ireland and the UK in terms of how they class locations and zones. It's very, it's actually, it was, it's certainly very different from Ireland in terms of how they, uh, class zones and stuff. Sorry, I'm just... I don't really know where I'm going, I'm just kind of wandering around randomly. I should probably just go and try and get to Redan. Oh, All I'm right. on Mount Gelmir. First target now. I think you get that cool blue scale armor, although I'm not really using armor on this build. I'm naked. Yeah, I get skilled stuff. Skilled armor's cool. I like it. 
Yeah, it is actually. I just got that Hello. Pearl Drake Talisman plus one, so I'm Ooh. got some more. I actually magic need to negation. Go... I've been wondering what like talismans and stuff to actually use, and like I I I went and got Radigan Sword Seal, mm. but then I was like, I don't really want to use that because I don't I'm not I'm already vulnerable and I don't want to make myself more vulnerable. So like. I'm currently just using the Turtle Talisman and the Axe Talisman for charged attack damage. Yeah. Um, and then... Oh, let's re-get that recipe. Um, sugar, what was it saying? And then I think I'm going to go and get the regular uh, Shield Talisman. The Drake Shield Talisman for extra defense. That's the plan. Sounds like a plan. I need to get but, more, um, what are they called, tears for the wondrous physic? So I went on a massive collecting spree and before even killing a single boss I got 10 plus 10 Estus Flasks. Oh my days. Yeah man. And I missed out on, uh, on some Wait, golden and tears. Wait, plus 10 Estus Flasks? I'm only on plus 3. So you get, you get one from Caelid. You get three from Lower Liarnia. You get one in the Third Church of Marika, which is where you get your physic. So there's yeah. five already. I've actually you just get... acquired a sacred tier right here. <laughs> you get one after Godric, just literally left in the Church of Erelith. Um, there's not right, one in the Rose Church. The church. Wait. So you come out of Godric's, Wait, like the back of the castle. So you have the lake facing Cliff's Grace. And then yeah. on that path, oh, yeah, that's... and then there's that church there. There's the church here where you find tops. Yeah, that's part of Lernia, um, the lakes, yeah. Then there's well, there's a church just after rise. East Raya Lucaria Gate. So, like, when you go through the first gate, if you then go through the second one, they'll teleport you to the path that'll take you to the deck that's left. Um, and then there's a church on the left side. There's another one. There's the Church oh, of Inhibition on the Madness one. Hill. That's a really easy one. About. Yeah, and then there's two churches, there's the Stormcaller Church and the Second Church of Marika in Altus. And uh, the other two are Consecrated Snowfield and Mountain Dub and Giants. So currently I have... Never mind, I have done Bellum Church. Yeah. You have? I didn't think I had, but I had. I didn't think I had, but I had. I've still got a few things I want to collect. I've got weapons, which I know I know where the weapon upgrade I want is. Which is just mm. a direct upgrade to the ones I'm using. And then, I want to go get an Ash of War. Uh, Cragblade. Oh, yeah. Which gives you like a 15% damage buff, but then also the main thing is extra poise damage. Oh, enemies right at the door. <clears throat> All these things are gonna kill me. They do a lot of damage. Oh, maybe not. Oh. I see a bunch of jars. Jar friends! <gasps> and a big troll. Oh, these are not jar people. Have you been to Jarburg yet? Actually, I haven't. I should go to Jarburg. You know what? We'll do that. I'll try and get down to... I'll get down to the bosses down below. And then I will go to Jarburg. And visit the home of Alexander. <gasps> I almost went flying off the edge with Torrent. Oh dear. This bridge was a trap. The bridge was a trap. It's okay, I've avoided the trap. A 
It's a trap. It's a trap. Oh. What's this dude? Why is it locked onto? I just got killed because for some reason the lock on locked onto these birds and we're further away than the enemy that I wanted to lock onto. Really? The death counter still isn't up to. What is wrong with this thing? <laughs> I'm, only... I'm not having a good time today. It's not it's no. not having a good time today. It doesn't sound like it. Nothing Why seems to be cooperating updating. with you. Updating. Save scene. Save those numbers that are there. It will refresh. I mean, it's been fine every other day, Why so it's just it weird that all of a sudden it's... Why? Yeah, it just doesn't... Well, no, there was some days that it didn't work properly and I had to refresh the stream twice. I just don't understand why it's not working now. It hasn't yeah, worked once. I've been poisoned. And I wouldn't mind, but it's simply just a text box. Like, it's not like... I might actually remove it if it's not going to update, because it doesn't look good having it there with no numbers yeah, after. Yeah, I know it's... yeah. Also, fun fact, you know how I was saying the first the fight with the grafted scion isn't technically a death? If the scion's the yeah. one that hits you. The scion actually only leaves you with 1 HP, so you don't actually die, you just get put down to 1 HP. So that's not a death. Which I... I actually didn't know that. I, I died in mine. Like, if you jump off wisps, the cliff, you going die. Away. Well, no, like, you know, the, like, souls thing I, that happens? It looks like you die, but you don't actually. But I saw the souls leaving. Yeah, it looks like it, but you don't actually. It's weird. It's, it's, it's odd. It's scripted, but, like, yeah. I don't know. If he, if the Scion hits you, you don't, te you don't actually die. I like interest in Dark Souls trivia. Also, as a further fun fact, did you know that even if all your stats were zero in this game, you'd still have about 500 HP? What? How? Yeah, so even if you, if you have no vigor, you still have one HP. Because there's like baseline stats for oh, your so character. Oh, still have one HP. Well, no, not one, but you'd, like, if you had zero into Vigor, you would still have, like, 518 or something, or 28 HP. How strange is that? Because sure I'm pretty sure I only just got over 500 HP. Like, by putting points into Vigor. I thought the well, starting I mean, was, like, 400. I mean, my Vigor stat's 30, and I'm at 994. Okay, where am I meant to go here? Oh, um, this way. Yeah, there we go. Uh, it's because I was watching a video, it was like, can you beat Elden Ring? Uh, or can I beat Elden Ring if, um, if I have negative stats? And it's like, to get true, like, nothing in stats, you have to lower your character's level to negative 18 in each category, which equates to a total of like 218 or 2 something in total. Because every stat, I'm pretty sure every stat at a threshold will increase your health. That's how it's done. But Vigor is yeah. the biggest increase. Um, but it's odd, because in every other game, if you put your stats to zero, I, f I don't know if it worked in the same way, but I remember people would just mod the value of the health mm. if they were doing like a... Like, I remember watching Lobos Jr.'s uh, VODs uh, when I was younger, if I'm doing like the... The one HP mage run or something like that, or the one stamina run. It's like, whoa. Um, but it was really interesting watching, uh, watching a bit of that because he had the, he's using the storm, the serpent hunter, because it is the only weapon that doesn't have like requirements at all. Which is weird to say, because even his Estus and like the torrent ring, even though those don't have stat requirements, they still said. You don't have the stats to wield this. Whenever yeah. you try to use it, <laughs> which is really funny. <laughs> Bizarre. Okay, I just the... got the Caleb map. Next bonfire, I find I shall 
Go to Jarberg. Sprinty, sprinty, sprint. Oh, there's a side of grace over there. Aha! Wait, where does that teleporter take you? Okay, I've got to, I've got to see where this is gonna take me. Travel oh. to another location. Ta-da! Okay, we're gonna update this. Uh, we're gonna update this death canter once more. And if it doesn't appear with the number this time, I'm just gonna hide it. Let's have a look and see what happens. No, nope. okay, I'm just gonna hide it. Uh, let's see where I've teleported to now. Oh, it teleports you right into the middle of Redman Castle? Really? Okay, I'm a little bit surprised by that. Wait, what? I see a side of grace over there. Oh, it teleports you right up to the boss fight? What? You can skip fighting your way the whole way here? I'm a little bit surprised by that. Okay. Cool. Well, we're going to edit the stream name because I forgot about Jarberg and we're going to go to Jarberg. Jarberg today. Done. Okay. I think you could just fast travel through there. So, Jarberg is over here. I have to get there through there, though. So we'll go Academy Town Gate. Let's do this. This isn't progressing Alexander's quest, but it will progress Jar Baird. Or Jar Baird. I can't remember his name. I'm not sure. The little Jar. The little Jar. The little Jar. The little Jar who also wishes to be a great Jar warrior. It's such a cute quest. Adorable. What? Too bad that that's not a cute quest. It's so it's the saddest quest in the game, Ken. Little fella is just here to fucking. Sorry, language. I know. Uh, <laughs> just to avenge. <laughs> that is a really. I'm sorry. I'm trying. I'm really trying. Yeah. <laughs> trying to keep it family friendly here, Ken. No, I'm sorry. Hey, um, you'll be you'll be banned from the party chat in no time. Uh, no, I'm messing. I know. I know. But I am. I am trying to not be a mischievous man but um no he's just a little cute because he's just trying to be a a warrior like alexander yeah it's a little what, messed what up how he's... Is not... <laughs> yeah it's just a little messed up but you know <laughs> we look past the details and everyone... we accept spoilers everyone dies i know but gotta look past it man oh my goodness the guy that drops you the bulgo armor, I forgot how mobile he is for someone who is in the heaviest armor in the game with the heaviest weapon possible. <laughs> he got he got big stats. He has murdered me. <laughs> he is he's so big. <laughs> Just got taken. I know, that was rough. Oh, I went the wrong way. Um I think I have to go up and jump down. Uh, how do I get up? That's the question, though. Can I do it from there? I went the wrong way. I forgot how to get a Jarberg because it's so nicely hidden. Because it's I actually hidden can't from remember. the poachers. I don't know if I've ever actually been. Well, I have, but like. I remember oh, that's when. Too far down. I'm not, I'm not... Oh, I am getting down there. There's, there's these stones that I can hop on. Oh, yes. Well, that actually hurt. <gasps> no, no, 
No, no, no, we're having a bad time. Oh, we got down. I thought I died there. I thought I was gone. Right, I've rolled him. So now all I need to do is behave and I'll win. Oh, I got the ads for Rapier and I didn't equip it. <laughs> oh, because I have to put an Ash of War on it so that it does uh, bleed as well as Scarlet Rot. I was going to say, is it a somber weapon or just a smith and stone weapon? No, it's just a smithing stone weapon, unfortunately. Because I would hey. be able to level it up much higher if it was a somber weapon. But I don't yeah. think I have very many smithing stones right now. Well, I was also just thinking, because obviously you can put uh, an Ash of War on it. So yeah. Like, okay. But what well, Fang's a, a somber weapon, it can get an Ash of War, no? No, I think I had that to plus 25. I think. Oh. Oh my goodness, the Bulgo stuff is very heavy. How much stronger is it? It's not really stronger, it's kind of weaker, to be honest. Alright, what that now? Now all That's I need is some rag blade. Oh no, I changed the scaling by putting this on it. Mm. I need some more points in arcane then. Uh, okay, well, we're on the way to Jarberg, so we'll go to Jarberg. And then what I'll do is I'll go to that um, uh, that mine that gets me the oh. bell bearing. All right, I'm gonna put your stream back on now. I've I've witnessed everything I need to witness. What did you witness? I just have to look up like quest stuff and where to find Cragblade. And Cragblade is literally oh, found. That should go there. Go down to <clears throat> down to where the man actually is. Done. Oh, I don't remember this being shaped like this. Where am I? I don't remember the land being shaped just as this is. I forget if there's places you can farm Smith and Stone 6. Is that only in the mountaintops? Mm, yeah, I don't know where to get any of the stones except for how to get stuff from like EG and the bell bearings. Because I know that in, um, in one of the mines, uh, what is it, in the Altus, the uh, sealed tunnel, there's a really easy uh, farm for Smith and Stone fives. You just go into the first site of Grace and take on the the little fellas with the cages, the little miner guys, and they've got a chance All to right. drop. Uh, they have a chance to drop Smith and Stone five, which is really handy if you're doing a Smith and Stone run. <clears throat> Oh, it's also be a mariner. It's also the location you get the second bell bearing anyway, so it's like, well, you're there for that, which will get you to plus 12. You might as well get the thing to plus 15, you know? Oh, beast eye quivers. Oh, is it just that the tibia mariners drop the things for the beast clergyman? Uh, there's also other ones. Like, there's... Um... There's death roots that you can find elsewhere in the game as well. Death roots, that was the word I couldn't remember. <laughs> but the, all the tibia manners, heavier manners, they all drop. Mariners, yeah. They, yeah, those ones. The manners. Those ones. <laughs> those boys. The manners, the good manners, they drop them. <laughs> they have good manners. They have excellent manners. I love boatmen. 
people complained about like, oh, reusing bosses everywhere, and then it's like, oh my god, it's a seventh boatman. <laughs> oh my god. How many boatmans are there? Not seven, but there's a few. There's like five. Ah, uh, it was a surprise attack. Okay, where are the stones to fall down? There we go. Ooh, this one's like more dangerous than some of the other ones. Oof. <coughs> Did you buy the telescope off of one of the merchants? No, no, don't fall. Ah, oh, I'm dead. Oh, I didn't die. Uh, <laughs> no. I never use the telescope. I usually buy I'm sure it. <laughs> I'm sure it's for something, but no, it's just I don't think for I ever used it. Like I bought it my first playthrough. It doesn't really have a use to it. Either. I think it's just for like helping you free aim stuff, or just to look okay. further ahead. I have arrived in Jarburg. Welcome to the home of the great Alexander. What's up, fellas? We should go talk to the only person who we can talk to. Well, you can progress um, your man's quest okay. line, can't you? <clears throat> can you not progress them to Jarburg? Uh, yeah, but you got to do a bunch of other things first. You want to fight some bosses? Hello, cuz. I didn't think anyone knew about this place, except us Jaws. The words hello cuz are not things I ever expect to hear from you. <laughs> Wait, we're we're listening, we're listening. <laughs> I'll be your potentate. Me. Truly. That's wonderful news. It's not easy being potentate though. I know. Oh yeah. Show me your hands. It's just a little test, cuz. To see if you've got the right stuff. Here are my hands. See them. Mm. Your skin He's not happy with my hands. So smooth, is it? You need no. slick, slidey hands to be potentate, you know. Oh dear. I'm sorry, cuz, but I don't think you've got what it takes. Oh no, What's I don't have what it takes to be potentate. But hopefully, I have what it takes to become a warrior, Jar. Don't look so glum, cuz. We can transform me, man. <laughs> potentate or not, come back and visit me. When you can. But he still Don't wants to be my drunk. friend. Well, you can still come back and visit me. Okay, I'll come back and visit. Ah, jar friends. Is he alive or is he dead? Can't tell. Let's explore all the wonderful plants that they have. Besides all the big like dead jars and the dead little jars, it's actually a nice place. I'm sure the real estate value is pretty high there. What do you mean the dead little jars? Can everything's alive when you go here first? Oh. I thought the little jars were I thought the what? Are the big jars yeah, still alive? Little... Uh there's some big jars that are still alive, yes. There are some very, very big jars that are not. Ah. But all these little jars are alive. They're uh, basking is genuinely... in the sun. Ooh. I think Jarburg somewhere I've only been once in my entire time playing this game. Oh, then you haven't done the quest. No, I haven't done it to that point, no. Oh, man. Oh, then that's why everything was dead when you came here. <laughs> yeah, probably. They're, they're well, all alive at the beginning. And, they, and you do the quest and they die over the course of it. Well, I... Well... Like, I went there when I was first playing the game. Hello, good sir. Um, because I spent like nearly 14 hours before moving past. Mate, my first 14 hours in this game were absolutely insane. I had like cleared out Caled, Lyernia, <laughs> uh, Limgrave, and I hadn't killed Renala or Redan. <laughs> I'd only done Godric. <laughs> I had no idea what I was doing. I didn't go and find the glintstone keys. I was just everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, 
worst experience of my life. Although not really, it was actually good. Plenty of content. Oh, I got a great uh, golden rune from that. Nice. Okay. Oh. Actually reminds me, I could go get Godric's oh, great rune active. Godric's great rune early on is like, so good. Let's chat to this guy once more, see if he has anything else to say now that I've refreshed the area. Friend ahead. Oh. Hello, Hello again, cuz. Hello. You came back. I have good tidings for you, cuz. Have you oh. noticed the rare flowers growing in this village? <laughs> yes, I harvested them all last time. Some of them. And they said you'd be very welcome. Thank you. I already picked them all. That was really bad. <laughs> He's only now giving me permission. Oh. <laughs> it's a good thing I took the initiative here. <laughs> so. I could just imagine you like, oh, thanks for the permission, as you have your hands behind your back with like every flower from the place. Yeah. You just whistle and, here. whistle and walk backwards, just saying nothing. Many flowers. I don't even know what they're used for. We'll find out another time, I'm sure. Just crafting recipes. I know, but which ones? That I can't tell which you. Which ones can? Okay, let's lot, talk to Jarboy again. Pots that use flowers. Who knows? They might be of some use. He said, "Go on, cause go pick some flowers." Go I already have. I just harvested Who them knows? all. Does he call you cuz? Yeah, he does. He calls you cuz. Oh, right. I thought that's you were what... calling him cuz. That's why I was like, wow, I never expected you to ever say that. Well, that's why I said hello, cuz, because he said it in a very British accent. Oh. Let's give him a chat again. That is hilarious. Oh, hello, again. hello again. Say, cuz, <laughs> have you met Uncle Alexander? He yes, yes I have. But then he left to be a champion. I asked to go with him, but he said the path of champions must be trod alone. Oh. So heroic, right? I miss That's him. So sad. <laughs> if you see him, Alexander believes the path of champions should be trod alone. He's big and tough and strong. I have met him. He is wonderful. I wish to be friends with him. Uncle Alexander said he won't be back again. My home oh. is of the past, and the past, as they say, is a different country. I suppose that's part of being a warrior, isn't it? So, please don't it is. tell anyone, cuz. But I'm actually a warrior jar as well, and I'll have to <gasps> leave the village that's so exciting. to become a champion. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, he wants to leave the village Uncle to become a champion too. Come back. My home is off the... I suppose that's pop. Wonderful. We shall be warrior jars together. We shall be champions. Yas, Pots, Potman. West. You could be brothers in jars. Brothers in jars. Oh my god. <laughs> it's all coming together. <laughs> It's coming together. Okay. So now, I'm going to try fight the two guys before Rodan. Let's see what happens. I'm absolutely going to get diddled, but we're going to give it a go. Oh, yeah, no, 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 we're not doing that next. <laughs> but no, my, uh, I need to level up my weapon, because it's only plus one. Uh, which means I need to go to here. Never mind. I will do that boss fight after this. I will do this next. Okay, I only have another 30 minutes, and then I need to get off. Oh, you've only on for another 30? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we did just say you were going out today. Yeah. 
Okay, let's go get this somber smithing stone. Bell bearing. I can't remember the name. The bell bearing. It's not somber. It's just normal. Play it, so go. This flipping horse, dog? Play it, so go. Oh dear. Do they have all of, oh, they all have brass shields as well. Huh. I didn't know that. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna go in here. Where is the... There it is. <laughs> it took me a second to find the cave. It took me a second. Last time I tried... Oh. Last time I tried doing this cave, I was horrifically underleveled for it. What cave is it? Uh, I don't know yet. I have to get into it for it to notify me. If it's the first somber one, is that the Celia? Uh, no, it's not a somber one, sorry. No, it's the first normal one. Uh, so that's the Crystal Tunnel. <clears throat> Methinks. Mm, yeah, I haven't gone to the bonfire yet because I'm grabbing the items at the top. Uh, I say the items, the cracked crystals. Do you remember what cracked crystals are used for? I think for crafting glintstone pebbles to throw at people. Ah. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. That's not as useful as what I was hoping for. What are you hoping okay, for? Okay, Rare Lucaria Crystal Tunnel. That's what it's called. Oh, yeah. The boss at the end, you. Yeah, you have to. I did it recently. You have to hit him with a. You have to hit him with a heavy attack. Um, well, yeah, any any weapon will work after a few hits, but if you use blunt weapons like hammers or fists or clubs, like those do normal damage to those enemies. But like even before you break their uh, crystal. Oh, I just got killed by the first guy. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, I just got me... two hit by the first guy. Do you want me to get the next bonfire? I can come there and run that bit with you. Uh, no, it's fine. I should be able to do it. I might just have to skip all the enemies. We'll see. <laughs> There's not really much point in fighting them in that cave. <clears throat> uh, give me my souls back. It's the only cave you have to fight. There's a chest here, though. For your, um, Ooh, for your crystal at the end. The bell bearing. Oh yeah, I remember this. Sneak up on this boy. Ambassador. Yeah, I do like no damage to these guys. Oh, my heavy attack stuns him. Well, that's useful. Wait, from a rapier? Yeah. Oh. That is interesting. loads of bloodstains over here in this jumping puzzle bit. But I have managed to do it first try. Oh, although I have to do a run jump to get back. <gasps> oh, okay, if you steal the things that they're mining, they come chasing after you. They don't like that. I Which was mining that stone. <laughs> I mean, it makes perfect sense. <laughs> you stole my minerals. Oh my god. I just absolutely murdered a tree sentinel. Not a tree sentinel, a uh There's bird. An item over here that I want. Oh, 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 it's a shooty gun. It's a shooty one. I'm potentially about to die. Oh, I just died. No, I didn't think I would die like that. Ah! Oh, he did a long pokey stick. Oh, I didn't think I was going to die like that. That's annoying. 
yeah, I'm under leveled for this. Well, I don't think I'm under leveled for this. I think what it is is my. Well, uh, are you still using the sword seal? No, no, that's not it. No, 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 no. I'm uh, again, Ken. I am referring to the damage that I do, not the ah, damage right. that I take. <laughs> um. Uh, no, I just do basically no damage to them, and I think it's probably because this sword is completely unupgraded. <clears throat> well, have you got upgrade materials on it? I don't know, and that's why I'm here because I want the. Right. Bell why, why not just use your to... old one then? Ah, uh, because I've already taken the Ash of War off, and I'd have to go back and put the Ash of War back on it. <laughs> and the other one isn't that upgraded either. The other one is only like plus five. I really just need this bell bearing so that I can uh, buy a bunch and upgrade it. There's an archer down at the bottom, just absolutely pelting arrows up at me. I love running up and stealing the thing that the guys are mining. It's like <laughs> if I could just run up and grab it, like why do you, what, like why do you have to? Well, that's why you can just grab it because they've done all the hard work. Oh, that was close. Almost died. Okay, I have the shortcut. Oh, uh, did you say the Golden Great Shield is one of the things you use? Golden Great Shield? No, I don't know what that is. It's dropped from the knights in the capital. <gasps> I haven't been to the capital, so no. Good point. Although I think there's no, some it, knights it's, like that uh, elsewhere. It's the um. It's the uh, brass shield, and then once you can, the finger shield, the finger stone shield. Which I can't actually remember where to get the finger stone shield. I think it's in um. I think it's in the dungeon in Radan's. Uh, boss room. The Fingerstone Shield. It very well. Oh, sugar. I actually don't know where the Finger Shield is. I think it might be Radan's area. In the. What you're saying in the dungeon? Yeah, in the dungeon in Radan's area, yeah, I think. Well, I can't quite remember. <clears throat> it's weird to get that so early on, though, no? I don't have it. Well, I don't have it yet, but I think it's there. That's my guess, anyway. That makes sense. I don't know, I mean, if you go there and you don't fight it, you can always look it up and see. That was what? Was that three? I think that was potentially three heavy hits. Stunned him so that I can do a. Uh... Oh no, my. Someone is hit at the same time. Oh, there we go. We got him again. Oh, okay, it's gonna take me. Kidding. It's gonna take me maybe four or five uh, stuns to get this guy. Well, once oh, you wait, stun no. him, yeah. Okay, there's number four. Okay. I've just actually stun knocked him. Okay, and five. Yeah, it took. Wait, was that four? Or was that five? That was five. Okay, he's dead. Got him. That weapon is not that bad. Let's get okay. poison damage to those fellas. Let's go. Oh, not system. I was thinking. I was like about to like quick game, even though I was trying to go back to the round table hold. In my head, those two things were the same thing. Okay. 
Oh yeah, Enya. No, not Enya. Finger Maidens. Let's go. Offer bell bearing. Okay. Oh, they have so many things that I need to purchase as well. Anyway, uh... If I'm level 1, that means I don't need 2. I just need 4 and 6, which is 10. I already have 2. And I already have 6. So I need 8 of 1, and I need 6 of 2. 8 of 1, and 6 of 2. Lovely. That will get me to whatever smithing stone 2 gets you up to. <laughs> Funk. Well, I took you no matter. It's all this Lay out your arm. Okay. I don't have enough souls to continue to level up, but I have enough smithing stones. <laughs> oh my gargoyles! <laughs> gargoyles. I'm fighting this gargoyle for absolutely no reason. I don't need to kill it, but it's killed me three times and now I'm upset. <laughs> so, like, I kind of feel like on a principle I have to. I had it one hit from it. death and it killed me. No, you know what? I'm not wasting time on it. I don't need to fight it. I'm not going to fight it. It's the one that's standing okay. in front of the golden seed. And as soon as you go for the seed, it gets angry. Okay, weapon is now plus nine. We're in a much better place. Somber? No. No. Oh yeah, it's not a somber weapon. He's a... Nine, yeah. out of, nine out of 25. Still, that's... Uh, much better solid. than five. And much mm. better than one. <laughs> but the main thing is that you've got... Um, Blood build up on it and rope. And it's got a rot. It's got the two things. So my physical damage is really low. At least it feels really low. Yeah, it's like a level zero claymore does more than my plus nine in basic physical. <laughs> oh no! But that's the. Uh... The downside of the build, I guess. It's just what you gotta deal with. Okay, so now we're gonna try the two bosses over here. Now that we do a little bit more damage. Ah! Wait. I thought this was a boss. Blight is standing over there. But he's in the boss room. Wait, what's going to happen here? Is it going to cutscene? Is Blight going to fight with me? Wait, what? We never been there with. Long time. Seems we're fated to keep crossing. Not that happening. We find ourselves at a festival of combat. We find ourselves at a festival of combat. Once the strongest of the demigods. The way ahead is pleasingly simple. A path forged by sword and fang. Hmm. Nothing to do but wait. Until the festival begins. <gasps> you never guess who I can see. To do but wait. <gasps> it's Alexander. Oh, yeah. <gasps> yes. <Welcome>. Yes. Ah. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> <laughs> Shattering awaits you. Champions, prepare for battle. Defeat the general, claim glory, and grab Can that put great him the... rune. A celebration of war. The Radon Festival. Exciting. Now, I must talk with Alexander. Hello there, sir. You came. How delightful. I did. Indeed, I thought I might find you here. 
By the by, do you know for whom this festival is being held? Well, it is none other than General Radan himself. To think, I could face a great champion of the Shattering, a demigod in the flesh. Oh, God. In truth, I quiver at the thought. Such is his frightful repute. But the fear simply assures me the ordeal is worth undertaking. Be sure to get a good vantage, my friend. I, Iron Fist Alexander, do hereby vow to unflinchingly brave this ordeal. I vow too to brave this ordeal with you, Alexander. We shall go together to battle! <laughs> Are you, doing, are you doing Redan now? I think I gotta do Redan now. Young chum. Are you good and prepared, young chum? Begins. The festival begins! Ha ha! I'm ready as I'll ever be. Oh, cutscene. Poor Leonard. That abused horse. I think it's his best life. Woof. <laughs> I love that that's what you get from the cutscene. <laughs> Nothing else. He said mansion hands on like a, like a dog. I think they call that a cannibal, but... Champions, the rebels begin! The celebration of war! The Redan Festival! You will find the field of battle past the church. General Radan is there, even now. Even now. Divested of his oh. wits, devouring corpses, and howling at the sky. Alexander, follow me. We must go to war. <laughs> Alexander, just sitting there staring at me like, what are you on a bit? Uh, <laughs> let's go. Onwards. I didn't realize it was here at night time, so that the thing just started up. <laughs> yeah, you don't need to fight that other boss that you did. Yeah, I'd never done that before. I've always fought those two bosses. Well, no more you know. I gotta do Blythe's thing every time. But you don't need to do Blythe's thing to do it. What? What? What stops them from spawning? Just if you it being kill, nighttime already? No, if you kill two shard bears, you just don't have to fight any bosses. You just go straight there. That well, you have to trigger the oh. Redan Festival, um, which you can do through Blythe. You can go to Rani, or you can just kill two shard bears and activate the lift. Which you've went up to the okay. altars, haven't you? I have, yeah. That's what's done it. Well, I've done all of those things. I've killed two shard bears as well. Yeah. Oh, I'm about to get shotted. Uh, horsey! Oh, he got me in midair. Oh, this is not going to be good. Uh, who did I summon? Those boys? Okay. No! Oh, that was close. I almost died because there was lads in my way. I just got one shot! How did I just get one shot? He didn't one shot me the first time. Yeah, I'm... I, oh no, it's probably my... Oh, I don't know. We'll see how much damage I deal to him when I finally get up there. 
I'm gonna go on the long journey to get the uh, Dragon Crest shield. Awesome. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, I need to not forget that death. Summon all the champions. Okay, there weren't any champions over there. I don't know where Alexander is though. There he is! Alexander, we fight together! <laughs> Get him! <laughs> That thing. I don't know how to avoid this. Oh, he's angry. Oh, he just two hit me. Oh no. So, right at the start of the fight, if you go on torrent and run backwards a little bit, he'll actually just put his bow away. If you run back a bit and then run forward, he'll just put the bow away and start charging you with his swords. Oh, really? Yep. It's a weird thing, but um, it's, it's handy for if you don't want diddled with arrows from 10 miles off. I actually avo I actually was okay at avoiding the arrows. It was just, I wasn't prepared for him to just target me over all the other chaps. Mm. I still have not got a hit on him, and I've died twice. <laughs> so you say go backwards. They just run run away from him and then he's like, oh, okay, I'm gonna chase you down and then, yeah. Oh yeah, like I'm outside of his render zone. Oh yeah, he's coming now. No, no, he's took, he's taking the bow back out. Wait, no, he's shooting. Yeah, he someone. just starts shooting away from you. He won't actually shoot you. It's so weird, but also not unwanted. Summon Alexander. Alexander, join the fight. Join the fight, my good friend. Okay, it's time for me to go get a hit because he's killed everybody. <laughs> <laughs> you can resummon them. Oh, yeah, I do like no damage to him. I feel like you're gonna struggle with that build. <laughs> Oh, I heard the noise. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go up to the top of the hill so I can summon the rest of the boys back. Go get him, jump. Alexander the Great Jar has died. I must bring him back. He may fight again. That's not Alexander. Pretty sure this is Alexander. There's someone Blythe. Who's this? Oh no! Oh no! He came crashing down from the sky. <laughs> I got so far away from him, I didn't know what was happening. And uh, he was crashing, he was coming crashing down from the sky, was what was happening. Yeah, I've just seen it. <laughs> Honestly, I'm surprised I lived. Where are the balls going? Where are the balls going? Who are the balls attacking? Why are the balls not coming down? I think they just float around them for a while, and then they'll randomly just shoot at you one by one. This so that I can block them if they do come down on me. Come 
going to bleed off. Oh, Alexander is still here. And Blythe is here. Oh no, he's come for me. I'm dead. <laughs> that wasn't terrible. Danny Wagon. Who's Danny Wagon? I don't know, but they followed you, dog. Thank you for the follow. <gasps> we just hit our follower goal of 30. No way. Nice. What do you like to Danny see? Danny Wagon, you've broken us over the, uh, the follower <laughs> goal. Wait, account created five minutes ago. <gasps> I, I think I might know who Danny Wagon is. I have a guess. Rigged. Me. Wait. Is Danny Wagon who I think it is? You know me. Yeah, no, I, I, I know who it is. I know who it is. You, you don't know him, Ken. No, <laughs> why not? Okay, never mind then. Bean. Ben. Yay. Yeah, I know who it is. Thanks, Daddy. Thanks for dropping in. Oof. I don't know if you just saw that, Ken. Uh, no, I'm currently in the Redan boss fight as well. He arrowed me. In midair. Do you have to click the boys summons like once for them to yeah. come in? Alexander! He wants me. Oh yeah, he really wants me. Uh oh. <laughs> Forgot if he summoned patches and just despawns himself. Into fight! Down, actually killed oh. me. Yeah, I just got one shot. Okay, I need to remember that. That's two deaths. Oh dear. So I'm yeah, on 30 um, deaths in total to play through now. It was the second second phase transition. He just came flying in and actually like nailed me. <laughs> yeah, this is uh I don't know if it's because I have no resistances or if I'm actually potentially under level for this. I can't quite tell which one it is. Why is he not doing the AI thing? It might be because I'm wearing no armor. Ah, uh, Radan? Support man, Alexander the Jar. summon anyone who has fallen. Why am I running so slow equipment if I'm not blocking and dodging? I am blocking, I'm using a block build. Uh, but the... Uh, I'm not dodging as often as I probably should be. <laughs> slightly for content, but also slightly for other things. I'm starting to think I might be under level for this, but we'll see. What's he doing? 
is he going into space? Yeah, he's going into space. I don't know who he was targeting when he went into space, though. All right, Radon's dead. Done. Okay, he wasn't targeting me, so we're all good. All the boys gotta be resummoned. Although I think, <gasps> no, Alexander died. Sad times. To battle. In we go. Lionel has died. Clyde dies and might resummon him. Because he's a cool boy. <laughs> the cool boy. <laughs> Clyde is the bestest of voice. I can't disagree. So, just is. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I actually blocked that attack. <laughs> that one. But Blight's actually really strong in this. Yeah, some of the other boys are dead, so we gotta re some of them. It does like 50 damage a slap. Ah, uh, no, but he does, he's quite tanky. I haven't had to re-summon oh, right. Blight since I summoned him the first time. Yeah, he is pretty good for that. Okay, I might be, if I can proc a bleed here, might be able to get this. Oh, but I just died. Everyone's dead, it's just me. I'm gonna die. Okay, run away. Run away. I must resummon Alexander. Mm, this may be the end of the summons. Well, if you run around, you'll find more. They keep... they, they never go away. <clears throat> oh, someone's still alive. I'm not finding any. Oh, there we go. Oh, I got Blyde back in the fight. Get in here, boy. The most important man. Where's Alexander? Where's Alexander? I can't find Alexander Summon, and I want to finish the fight with Alexander. Oh, oh no, he's crashing down from space. Where is he? Where is he? Which way is he coming from? This way. Okay, he didn't attack me. Who did he target? Whoa, I've never seen that before. Wait, did he do that twice? Yeah, he did it twice. Wow, you're really dragging that fire. <laughs> yeah, he's about to die, but I can't find Alexander. More than my boy. Okay, he's dead. This is really sad. Where is Alexander? <laughs> I basically didn't fight him there. <laughs> oh no, maybe there is a limit. <laughs> basically uh, all the guys fought him instead. And I just ran it. around. Yeah, I was watching. Oh dear, look at those calves. That fight. Look at those calves in that cutscene. Oh, I... Look at those calves. Oh my god. Those are I am legs. one step closer to being... The jar concert of Alexander. <laughs> yes, Danny. I know you might not. I don't know if you've looked up anything about this game, but uh, Alexander was. I don't know if you ever saw him in that fight, but he was the big jar character, and he is uh, called a jar warrior, and uh, he has a side quest line in the game. He's not like here he is. This is him here. Uh, he's a side quest in the game, and when you do part of his side quest, he gives you a helmet where you can put a jar on your head, and that is my, that is my aim for this game, is to become a jar warrior, just like Alexander. Well, let's go like one of two. Alexander. 
that's goal one of two. Goal, goal two is to get the great jar. Oh, you yeah. have to do memes. that. You have to do There's that before um, before the end it's of the game. It's also why I'm... The memes are why I'm naked. <laughs> uh, okay, let's chat with him. How jarring. <laughs> it was a battle That's terrible. You are well and truly a champion, friend. Yes. I, on the other hand, am nothing but a crock. One hit was all it took to crack me, and for my inside to come spilling out. After that, I... I hid like a coward, and I such... Oh. I can hardly stand to face one such as you. <gasps> but Alexander, you are the great Jar Warrior. Thank you, sir. It is an honor. He, um, I'm wondering if I couldn't find his summon because of what he says to you afterwards. He says that uh, he took a hit and that uh, he hid for the rest of the battle. So maybe after you summon him a few times, you can't summon him anymore because he's actually hiding. I actually think there is a limit on but don't you think I've um, just yet. on how yes, many times you can summon up, people. Alexander. There's a veritable mountain of warriors' bodies right here. If I can just squeeze this bunch down inside me, I'll be a mighty warrior again in no time. And yes, you know, the bodies found here are exceedingly fine. Who could expect any less from the very warriors who fought in the shattering, the greatest of all wars? Hm. Just you wait and see, friend. I'll grow even stronger. He calls Just me friend. You wait when next we maybe, meet. maybe I am his consort. Oh, what's what's that meme? Hey, uh, it's Ultron. Eh, uh, not Ultron. Jarvis. No, not Jarvis. What's his name? Ah, balls. Oh, and Blight is here Vision. as well. When Vision goes, maybe I am the, the you know the one, right? I can't fathom how Radan was holding back something of that scale. It's not worth it anymore. He was a living legend. Give up. Well, <laughs> it died. It died immediately when Radan, I forgot the, <laughs> the character. <laughs> I love how they're all calling me a fine warrior, and I did like by far the least <laughs> amount of damage on Radan. <laughs> They're all being like, oh, you are a fine warrior, and even Alexander is praising me, and I'm like, I did nothing in that fight. Anyway, it is past time when I said I was going to get off, uh, so I need to I need to go. Uh, I'm going to mute you for a sec, Ken, and I'm going to end the stream. Yep. Uh, so I'll chat to you in just a moment. Yep. How do we do this again? X to mute everyone. Uh, cool. Okay, well... Today was a good... Oh, Alexander's already gone on to his next mission. Uh, as soon as I sit at the bonfire. Um, yeah, thanks, Danny, for dropping in and dropping a follow. You were my 30th follower, which hit our goal. Uh, thanks, everyone, for dropping in as well. There was a few people in and out. Uh, Miss Pank, or Mr. Spank. Uh, Kendo as well for chatting along in the party. He's also been playing. Uh, and thanks anyone else who dropped in and gave a watch. Uh, if you're ever interested in anything that you've missed, I upload all of these to YouTube. You can get them, uh, yeah, you can watch the VODs on YouTube if you ever want to watch them again, or if you ever want to see anything that you've missed in the journey. Uh, I'm actually going to go live again tomorrow night, uh, is the plan. Uh, so if you are around, uh, it'll be probably around 12 p.m. Pacific time, which I think is 8 p.m. Uh, Irish time, which is GMT minus one or plus one at the moment because of summertime. So yeah, you can come and drop it then. Thanks again, Danny, 30 for the win. 